understand you. But you have to also know that it has not been very easy with her also. She's hurting. It has not been easy for me as well. It's been a terrible journey. I love that girl and it hurts seeing her like that, knowing full well that I, I caused her the pains. I don't eat, I don't, I don't sleep, I don't do nothing. All I do is wake up and think about her. It's, 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 it's terrible. It's terrible. I yeah. know, I know. But I still insist you give her a little more time. Like I said before, she's hurting. Give her time I'm, I'm, to... I'm sure she would come around. I'm sure, I know. Just give her time. But like when? I'm losing my mind. Please help me talk to her. I don't care how you're going to do it, but please. Please. Sure, I will. See, I love what you both shared. And I'm going to do everything within my power to make sure it continues. But for now, do not overthink things. You need to continue pushing, but not overthink things. Alright? She'll come around. I know. Just take it easy on yourself. Okay? <sighs> Okay, that's the way you so, said. So take me home now. Alright. Good morning. But you will, you will um, talk to her, right? Yeah, sure. I will talk to her. I'll okay. talk to her. How is she? She's okay. She's fine. Don't worry, relax. Relax. Yes. I can't relax. So. <laughs> I'm not relaxed. Don't you, don't, you don't understand. I do. <laughs> I know how it feels. I do. Sure, I do. But she would come around. Sure. Okay. Your phone. Yeah. How is my guy now? <laughs> <laughs> Greg is fine. He's doing great. He's obviously taking care of me, as you can see. Yeah, of course I can. <laughs> no, he's a great guy. Yeah. He's a great guy. Yeah. So you're taking this way? Yeah. Yes. Your belt. Oh. <laughs> I don't mind my manners. That's alright. Sometimes I forget to. <laughs> <sighs> so. Guess whom I saw today? Who did you see? You know, I don't like this guessing game that people engage in these days. Honey, does that mean you're not in this day? I am 1956 <laughs> model. <laughs> I, we are here. I don't understand you both. <laughs> I, I stopped by at the renovation project we awarded uh, to the orphanage home to see how it's going. Okay. And uh, and what, mom? Mom, there's already so much going on right now. Just save us the suspense. Would you please allow me to serve the moment? Okay. All right, honey. Yes. Remember the girl that paid for the vocational training at the orphanage. The girl that has been so supportive of the foundation. Which you said you would like to meet someday. Of course I do. What about her? I saw her today. Ah. Do you know everything Madame Joy has been saying? Chima Amanda is a lady behind everything. You don't say? Of course. You mean she was the one spending so much for the foundation. How did she manage to do this? Even with minimum force? Chief, you can say that again and again. Do you know that when I went to the foundation today, I saw her. I am as shocked as you are. It is hard to believe that Chima Amanda, the prostitute, is the one Madame Joy has been talking about. Well, I, I know it's surprising to you all. Well, it was surprising to me at first. Chimamanda is, 
is a girl with a heart of gold. She is selfless to humanity. This is not even the first motherless baby's home she has been to. She has taken me to like three or four across the city. Not to talk of the hospitals where we have gone to pay, pay hospital bills for, for, for the sick people. So when, when you saw her, did you try talking to her? I had wanted to talk to her. I stood there in shock, gazing at her with my mouth wide open. But when I wanted to talk to her, after everything, they said she had left. Yeah. This is unbelievable. That part pained me. Well, what is important right now is to get Chimamanda to forgive us. It's for us to get ourselves out of this situation so that she can forgive my brother and I. She's been given the coldest of shoulders. Yes, we deserve it, but seriously, it's, it's killing me. I'm dying inside for this forgiveness. Uchechuku, calm down. My son, calm down. That notwithstanding, we find a way to make it up to her. Personally, I feel so bad. I do, I feel terrible. Because of all the hurtful things I said to her. I feel so embarrassed. What if she were my child? That is a problem, Mom. How do we go about it? How? Well, leave that for us, son. We'll see what we can do. Okay. Amanda, you have to snap out of this mood you are. I know it's hurting, but you, you don't have to let it be cloud your sense of reasoning. You don't! You're saying all of this because you obviously do not know what it means to be raped. You obviously do not know. You don't! I may not know how it feels to be raped, but I do know it hurts. And this scar remains fresh for almost a lifetime. Especially when you've not forgiven the rapist. Come on, girl. It's okay to we are talking about here. I know you became a prostitute as a result of the rape. But after many years, he saw you and fell in love with you, notwithstanding what you do for a living. What he did to you back then was evil. But I know he's sorry. He's deeply sorry. That's where you got it all wrong. Yes, Okechuku doesn't love me. He knows everything. He knows. That was why he was acting all nice, sympathizing with me. And you know I hate something like that. Mother, can you just stop it? You know you're lying. Okechuku loved and cared for you the very day he met you. And you know that. And I'm telling you that he does not love me. Okechuku was only sympathizing with me because he knew full well that, that he put me in this mess. Can you, what are you telling me? Can you just stop it? Can you just stop it for once, Amanda? See, I know it's hurting. I understand you. I you know don't it's understand me. You have no idea what I'm passing through. That is why you're raising your voice at me instead of trying to... Please. Can you just calm down? It's hurting, but you have to relax. You have to calm down. It is well. It's not good for you. Come it out of this mood. It is well with my soul. It is well. Amanda, I'm your friend. It's not like I'm supporting Okechuku, but please. You need to come out of this mood. He's sorry, and he's sorry for real. Please. You're hurting yourself. And it's not good for you. Baby girl, I'm a baby. Please.
só. What troubles you? It's Chimamanda. So, what about her? She has refused to see me nor talk to me. I can't be at peace until she forgives me, Dad. I can't find peace in myself anymore. Well, uh, it's good that uh, you are truly remorseful after what you did. I know that. What I did was really wrong, Dad. And I'm hurt about it. I can't even be at peace with myself. I just want to make amends for everything I have done. I, I know it's not easy, but I just wish she forgives me. I'm ready to do anything for her to forgive me. Well, it's all right. Hmm? Don't worry yourself. Everything will be fine. Well, I'm sure she's not finding it easy also. Considering the psychological trauma that she went through as a result of the rape. Right? But don't worry. I will have a discussion with your mother. I will see how we handle the issue. Okay? Take it easy. Thank you, Dad. I... I really appreciate um, it. I'm glad you're going to talk to mom about it. It's all right. So, now you can sleep and snore, okay? Um, we just keep our fingers crossed, you know, and hope for the best, okay? Thank you, Dad. All right. Good night. Thank you, Dad. Good night. Yeah. <sighs> What have you come here to do? I told you to stay away from me, didn't I? But I can't. It's hard. What do you want? I have come.
come to ask for forgiveness. I want you to come back to me. You've come to ask for forgiveness? After what you and your brother did to me? Really? I am deeply sorry, my love. We are very sorry. I am ashamed of what I did. All I ask is the chance to make things right again. The chance to amend my wrongs. The chance to, to make retribution for what I did. With sympathy? Really? And you think that would heal me? You and your brother took away the innocence of a defenseless girl. A singular act that led me into prostitution at a very tender age. A big kudos to you. A big kudos. And you're here telling me what? What are you saying? Baby, I know. You know nothing. You know nothing, Okichuko. The best retribution for a rapist like you is for you to pay dearly for your sins. You know absolutely nothing. Nothing. Hook me up with your call. Don't worry, I'll call. I'll call. I'll call her later because I want to sleep. No, no, I'll call her later. Alright. It is with a heavy heart that I write this. With all my past, I would always tell you, and mine has finally caught up with me. I am so ashamed for what I did in the past. More so, it turned out to be the same person I promised to love and protect. It hurts. It hurts that I hurt you and it's hard to watch you shed those tears. I did what is evil before God and man and I have to pay for my sins. I must have been in the police cell by the time you see this message to pay for my sin against you. Please forgive me, Okichiko. Forgive me. Forgive me. Ok, 
Okay, Chukwu, I know you're with your phone. Just, just, just pick your call. Answer the damn call. Why did you call me back? Allow me to face my sins. I deserve every punishment that comes with it. I deserve it. I deserve even worse. Why did you do that? You think arresting yourself would, would kill me? Yes. 
Is that what you think? Yes. After what you and your brother did to me? If you don't know, Ikechuku, what you and your brother did changed my life for the worse. And that wouldn't have been possible without my uncle and his wife. But I can never hate you so much because of what you did for me. You took me in. You showered me with so much love. You cared for me without minding where you picked me from. You sacrificed a lot for me, and I know. But your revelation spoiled everything. It opened an old wound. It opened an old wound that I had covered over the years and managed to live with. Right about now, the wound looks so fresh and deep. <sighs> but your selfless sacrifices is enough to heal it. I have forgiven you, Kechuko. Forgive you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm very sorry, Amanda, for all the pains my brother and I have caused you. We regretted what we did that day, but we didn't have the courage to look for you to apologize. Please forgive us. I know we hurt you. I hurt you. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm ready to make up for it, to do anything, please. Anything you want me to do, please. No, I don't have to kneel for me, get up. You don't have to kneel for me. I know full well that what you and Okichuku did to me is really hurting. But at the same time, I think it's high time I forgive you people and move on with my life for me to be free and happy. I have forgiven you, Uje It's okay. It's My daughter, please forgive me. I didn't treat you well. I am so sorry, please. Okay. I judged you wrongly. It's okay, babe. Sorry. Sorry. Please forgive me. Forgive my children. I'm forgiving everybody, ma. Okay. Um, my pizza. Let's go inside. There's no lights, but I'll, 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 I'll turn the gen on. It's okay, please. Sim, 